uh, you know, we don't want this to happen, but it does happen from time to time where we get into a disagreement uh, with our wives and, uh, you know, you say something, she says something, you say something, and this time you say something more than you said the first time. She may say something a little bit more. It may come out a little bit harsher. And before you know it, you know, you are just beginning to turn up the temperature, turn up the heat, and I'm not talking in a positive way. <laughs> This is headed for disaster. And when you see that happening and when you sense, you know, your blood's boiling or maybe your, uh, your sweat showing up on your brow or your nose turns red, <laughs> whatever those symptoms are that you can recognize uh, before you say anything more to make things really worse and potentially end up at the doghouse, which on a winter night may not be very pleasant. Here's a very simple thing that you can do, and you both need to agree on doing this from time to time when things are beginning to get a little bit out of hand and you know there'll be more damage done. And you know what that is? You call a time out. <laughs> yes, you heard me right. You call a time out and you're saying, hey, uh, Pastor Jeeva, what are we doing here? Are we, are we in a hockey game or something? Well, sort of. <laughs> so just like in a game, when things are starting to get a little bit out of hand, uh, or maybe they're not, they're doing poorly, uh, the coach, you know, wants to get his team back on track. And what does he or she do? They call a timeout, or sometimes a player calls a timeout, uh, you know, in, in particular games. But the purpose of the timeout is really to put a break in what is going on, a temporary break. It's a pause, really. It's more, it's nothing more than that. But a timeout is not a signal of avoiding the conflict. A timeout basically signals to your spouse, to your wife, that, hey, I'm just not ready to deal with this now because I just don't want to do anything stupid. And so how about we take some time out? Uh, and, uh, and you notice that timeouts have a definite duration in the game. So an hour later, two hours later, tomorrow morning, uh, later in the evening, whatever it is, you agree on a time to get back and face the situation honestly and openly, and then come to a resolution. The next um, memo, I will tell you some of the things that you can do during the time order that are actually helpful that will promote this. But for now, remember this, guys, call a timeout. You can do uh, a signal like they do in the sports realm, or you can just use the words, uh, but talk about this with your wife ahead of time. And if you want more information about how to do a timeout properly, uh, shoot me a DM and I'll be glad to send you the details.